Few places are likely as lonely as retirement centers right now. But Wednesday afternoon, you got me there. Oh, that's so fun. Oh, yeah, yeah. A video call from California. This is not a typical Wednesday. Gave one resident a reprieve. And here yes, comes Pam. Is. There we this go. Is Pam. Hi, how are you? That was Sherry. Hi, Hi, Hi Pam. Hi, Jane. Okay. Oh, look at you. You look so beautiful and colorful. Oh, tried to find something that wasn't too busy. Jane Seymour, the Hollywood actress, called in from her home in Malibu to paint with a retiree named Pam Altizer at her place in Dallas. Pam, are you seeing everything okay from Jane's yes. perspective? Yes, I'm seeing everything fine. When she's not on a set somewhere, Seymour is often in her art studio. Pam has dabbled in painting for years before moving into Presbyterian Village North. And both of them agreed to let us sit in and watch this session. So I'm using a purple instead of a black. That's beautiful. Give me one second. I'm going to get rid of this phone. For more than an hour, they chatted about paintbrushes and palette knives, canvas and colors, even COVID-19. Very, very difficult times, I think, for everyone. It's just hard to imagine, isn't it? Jane Seymour is reaching out to seniors and the homebound, hoping to inspire others. We all know that, you know, they're the most at risk for this virus, too. So I just thought, you know, bring some joy and some fun into the homes. But she wants her friends and yours to do something for someone and share it using the hashtag open hearted challenge. I think she said she benefited more from it at the end of the day, perhaps than the initial intention was. And uh, it's nice to have something to feel good about right now. The virus has changed a lot of what we do now. It's kind of fun to paint with someone else, you know. But Jane Seymour and Pam painting prove that the pandemic remains no match for generosity. In Dallas, I'm Jason Whiteley.